If you're looking to leave your car at home to explore downtown St. Petersburg, well, you are not alone. ABC Action News reporter Lauren Rosella is driving Tampa Bay forward with the free travel option more people are now using. More people looking to go car free. We've been telling you how more Bay Area families are using the Cross Bay Ferry to go from Tampa to St. Pete. It's a real quick hop. Saving all that time stuck in traffic. But what about once you cross the bay? Now PSTA says the downtown looper trolley is an increasingly popular option to get around St. Pete. And we added many more destinations so that not only tourists ride it, but also workers and residents. The downtown looper trolley starting where the Cross Bay Ferry drops off, then serving the Vinoy Hotel and looping around to the west on Central Avenue. It goes on to pass all of USF St. Petersburg and the hospital district. Then it comes back up past the Dolly Museum, Museum of Arts, Beach Drive and dozens of restaurants and shops. And to make things even faster, we increase the frequency or how fast the, the trolleys come. The Looper's 15 minute service runs by trolley or new electric bus all around downtown St. Petersburg seven days a week and it's always free. It also provides service during Tampa Bay Rays home games so fans don't need to worry about parking. And we have all of the information you need to know about routes and prices as well as schedules right on our website. It's abcactionnews.com. Just click on our driving Tampa Bay forward section. In St. Pete, I'm Lauren Rosella, ABC Action news. And if you have a driving Tampa Bay forward story idea or a tip, please call us at 866-428-6397. You can also email us at driving at WFTS.com.